Hey guys, I just had a really nice breakfast, so I thought I'd show you guys how to hack a PSP uh, 1000 or 2000 with an official firmware of 6.30. So you're going to download this pre-made Magic Memory Stick M336 from the link in the description. And you're also going to need a Pandora battery. And you can buy this at deluxetream.com for like $6.20. It's really cheap. And uh, what you're going to do is, whoa, what is this? Thank you, Windows. So, what you're gonna do is extract this to your desktop. <clears throat> and you're going to go inside. And you're going to install PSP Grader. I've already got it installed. And once you do, go into pre-made 5.00M334. And what you're going to do is you're gonna plug in your PSP. And my PSP should pop up in a second here. Okay, there we go. So go into your memory stick and what you do is copy this. No, delete this and copy this into there. Oh yes, and make sure you've backed up everything on your PSP before you do this. Yeah. So now go into the PSP grader and launch PSP grader and then click on here in target memory stick select your uh, memory stick and then click inject IPL only all done click OK and you are done so close it and let's go into my PSP now and I do have the latest firmware. This is version 6.30. So once you're done with all the files, pull out your Pandora battery. This is what it looks like. And turn off your PSP completely. So hold down the power button. Alright. Flip over your PSP and take out the battery. This is kind of hard because I am holding my camera. Let's see if I can just set it down. There we go. Pull out the old battery and stick in the new one. There. And once you stick it in, hold up on your PSP. And you should come to this menu. And uh, if you see this menu, then you're basically done. Alright, if you see the install 5.0 M33, install 5.0 official firmware. So select the very top one and click X. And when it says install complete, shut down and reboot is required, just press X to reboot your PSP. And guess what? You have the latest firmware. Well, the latest hacked firmware. Let's go down to system settings. X down to system information get my little paper here what's that M334 awesome and some of you are wondering why I block my MAC address and that's because Sony blocks PSPs if they see their MAC address and if they know they're hacked so I don't want to get my PSP locked so I cover up my MAC address, and I suggest you do too if you make PSP videos. So now you're going to update to M336, so go into your memory stick and launch the PSP update. Press X to install, just click X. And it's already complete. That was easy. <coughs> and there you go. You've got a PSP with custom firmware of 5.00 M336. And now you can put hacked games on it. And I will hopefully make a tutorial on that later. So make sure to subscribe, uh, like this video, and leave some feedback. I'll see you guys later.